Hi everyone! Last time when we played Final Fantasy XII, the Zodiac Age, we met the Vieras in the forest. We learned a little bit more about Fran, the people that she comes from, their rules and their beliefs, and how she got ostracized from them. There's still so many questions I have about her past and exactly what happened, and I'm really excited to hopefully find out more about that. Also, everybody has their second jobs now. I'm starting to form like some parties with party leaders. We have Vaughn as one party leader slash tank and then Bosch as the other. And just switching back and forth between those two as we go through it. And we now have passage through the jungle thanks to the Vieras. And we are going to make our way to Mount Boromaseis. Thank you guys for watching and enjoy. With Lente's tear, we can pass the barriers of Golmore jungle. The Grand Kiltius on Bur... Buramasace. It's beyond. Our business here is done. Okay, let's go. Let's go to the jungle. Let's have a good... fun stream tonight. Sixty teleport stones. Oh yeah, I was getting a lot of teleport stones from those. Ooh, look at us from those flans. Bur Omasis. Oh, so we. I believe this is the way to Bur Omasis. Do we want to explore? The rest of the woods i'm sure we'll come we'll come back this direction to go south at some point i guess we'll just keep going the way we're going for now easy enough to teleport back to the Ariut village or whatever and check out the other paths It is several years now since such as you began passing through the wood, unwelcome. Some sought only to flee their pursuers, but others there were who thought to bring ruin to the wood. This weakened, wakened in Myrn a deep disquiet. That she should see this and leave the wood surprises me little. I want to live in a magical wood. <laughs> Is it another boss fight? It's a great, the great mossy dragon. Oh, he's so cool. We have to fight him. Well, I, yep, I guess so. I guess so. The elder worm. Guy. There's treants here? Oh boy. Ooh, they're kind of beefy. Alright, get the other little guy. It's scary that something so big is actually the little guy in this situation. Alright, 
we should probably get rid of this stone thing or should we keep it i don't know i know it gives us increased defense as it gets closer to completely stoning us oh balthier is poisoned i mean not poisoned he's confused but we definitely want to get rid of that where's my thingy new kai sand Let's get a let's get rid of this stone. Oh wait, Pinello can do it. She has Stona. Yeah. of spores off of its body. What does that mean? Is it an attack? Spore fall? I'm poisoned. Nobody has an anti-poison thing. Do we have Poisona? We do. so much health still did it heal or is that just all the damage that i've done to it larsa is turned to stone nello still has mp so she should be doing heals and stuff something for that I have dispel remove harmful status effect from one ally Let's see what happens so ancient and majestic we should just leave it alone i'm sad about that drugged off the spore fall like it was nothing what did that do hi kilimaro what does the spore fall do hi fluffy Shadow of the Colossus vibes? Yeah, Shadow of the Colossus vibes, for sure. Aw, this poor thing. 
You wasn't doing nothing wrong to anybody. We just came into his house uninvited. Ooh, 9,000 gil. All right, which way? To the right. Hi, Ayo. This is your favorite Final Fantasy game? Nice. I wonder how this will rank on my uh, my Final Fantasies by the time we're done with it. I find it really difficult to rank those, though. Like, really difficult. Ether. Which way? Let's go north. Let's go up. Hi, surfing frog. This one is so different from uh in tone and vibe from the others yeah that i was thinking that too yeah like this one does feel quite different i feel like it does it's closest from what i've played it feels closest to final fantasy 16 to me i don't know if it's the i don't know just i don't know <laughs> i mean this is also the one that's, um, well, I don't know. Are the graphics for this much better than 10? Maybe it's just the modern graphics and kind of the setting that's making me feel like reminded of 16. Oh, maybe I should speed it up a bit. Oh, I'm sleeping. Somebody wake me up! Does she have a magic for waking somebody the fuck up? Wake up! Oh my, hello. Who's this guy? A dire sore. <laughs> He looks cool. He's got little fins. I got a tyrant hide. new Paramina Rift Paramina Rift we got ice now we got snow ooh Hiltius Mount Burr Amasas is to the northeast should you go south you'll enter the rift take care gods guide your path Haram beyond this rift you'll find the holy mountain each Take each step one at a time and you shall reach your destination. But quickly, right? Like, one step at a time, but with some haste because otherwise you'll probably freeze. The Kiltius of Mount Buramasis took us in and treated us warmly. Thanks to their aid, I'm well enough to return home now. To 
too cold and snowy for my tastes. You love snow levels in video games? Would you say they're your favorite? Or just one of your favorites? They are your favorite? Do you guys, what do you guys like? Do you guys have any preferences or a favorite? Like there's snow, there's field, there's forest slash jungle, a desert. What do you guys like? A uh, beach? Lava? <laughs> Castle? What do you guys think? When newcomers, oh, underwater. When newcomers, what can't walk on their own arrive, I carry them up the mountain. I'm glad to help the Kiltius any way I can. That's nice of you. Where are we on the world map? Oh, well, we're getting close. Might be a little bit of a ways. Actually, it might not be. You love snow? Mountains and waterfalls too? Volcano! Beach areas are your favorite? It's not far ahead of the others, but probably forests. I love forests too. Concrete jungles. Oh, like cities and stuff. Poison swamps. Oh yeah, I forgot about swamps. Dude, I love, I love swamps. Traditionally, you think you've liked lava levels, but it depends on the game. The music for this area is like on point. It's kind of spooky. A little bit. It's very fitting though for this environment. This is your favorite theme in the game? What's this guy? Wild onion? Anybody hungry? Yeah. Okay, um, oh, we don't have a map, so I guess we're just gonna pick a direction and just start exploring. Skull Knight, huh? Ooh, this. Ooh, that is nice. That's very nice. Oh my goodness, what the hell is all this? X potion. Is that my first X potion? Ooh. This song is called Seeking Power. I'm, I'm about to be seeking this song after the stream. Okay, now we'll go south. Empires parade down city streets while refugees walk barefoot through the snow. And so I sue for peace, to stop short war and ease their suffering. My father will choose peace. Will he now? You sound sure of yourself. You can never know another, even your father. True. Don't take it the wrong way, Kay. Uh. This crisis would not end were I gone. The Senate hates the very fact that House Solidor exists. By necessity, 
We must find reason to silence them. Necessity? Ah, yes. Necessity. Does that word free you, I wonder? You show no hesitation to solve matters with blood. The sword of House Solidor cannot be left to rust in doubt. It was you, Excellency, who tempered that sword. Is this your idea of vengeance? It is my idea of necessity. <sighs> if we do not act now, it is not only our future you imperil. So, you would dirty your hands to keep his clean. My hands are stained with blood. I see little reason to stay them now. <sighs> so they are. And so how solid all lives on. Solidor. Is that their house? I know it's... They brought up the name before, but I can't recall exactly who or what it is. The Emperor, Vayne, and Larsa are all from House Solidor. Or Solidor. Yes! One thing I kind of miss is the, uh, what was it called? Active time in 16? Active time lore, the ATL. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, sometimes it was just like, oh my gosh, there's so much lore, but the fact that it's optional is like, if you need to go back and check something or if you want to read it as it comes up then that's an, an option a nice option to have Ooh. i see some green i see some floating mount baromasis 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 Sand strewn path. So we're here at the sand strewn pass. At, I'm the base, or maybe we're no, we're not at the base. We've been up the mountain a little bit, I think. Mount Bromasace. Bro. His Grace, the Grand Kiltius. Anastasis watches over all Mount Bromasace, land closest to the gods. Can you not feel your soul's burdens lifted? Ooh, we got a shop. This mountain may be protected by the Kiltius, but should you venture to Paramina Rift, you'd best go prepared. Okay. All right. Let's see what we can sell. Oh, what else? Soul Eater. Consume HP to deal damage to one foe. Ooh! 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 Hiraga. Blizzara. Berserk. Ooh, Berserk. Mmm. Darkra. All right. You don't have to look. You don't have the look of a pilgrim nor a starving refugee. You have money? Go on, buy something. Oh, no, I'm broke. Sorry. 
Oh, you have weapons? Why didn't you say so? Ooh, Gladius. A dagger. Sledgehammer. Ooh, I need... Okay, I need... Axes and hammers. Four. I need maces three. Can I equip it? Oh, maybe I can equip it. Yes. What else? Is that it? Hymns. Many are the fiends that lurk in the crags of Karamina, but of them, the elementals appearing during heavy snows are the most dangerous. Oh, crap. Hey, Gertie. Welcome to the Chocobo stables. I don't need a Chocobo. Thank you, though. I do appreciate the offer. Here, on Mount Boromasace, the Kiltius protect us, yeah? We will not need to leave our home again, yes? Oh, where are you from? Refugee from where? Be at ease. Mount Boromasace is a holy place. Protected by the gods themselves, you need not fear a thing. Well, this place seems just really nice. Good people here. And, like, actually. Cartographer's Guild. Howdy, Pilgrim Capo. Would you like to buy a map? Oh, yes, I would. Carmina Rift map. And... Mount Bromasace map. Ooh, okay, let's take a look. Okay. I think we're ready to do another boss fight. Actually, I would love some, a big chunk of like story uh, progress cutscenes. Okay, I think we're ready to go. We gather in this place because Mount Boromasace is the holy mountain of the Kiltius. We are safe from empires and their wars here. Yeah, but for how long is the question though? Always hunts. Oh yeah, we do have some hunts we could probably take a look at. This is not the best land upon which to make a living, but here we are, safe from armies and fiends. That is enough. I was set upon by fiends in Paramina Rift when the Kiltia saved me. I owe them my life. More than 10,000 souls find peace on Mount Boromasace. Our doors are open to all. The, bless the blessings of the gods be with you, Faram. We cannot rely on the Kiltius to provide everything for us. We must do what we can to help. Well, the place that's free from, like, the Empire's claws this is very nice isn't it this place reeks of poverty there's not a thing of value in the whole camp uh what i just said you didn't hear that i'm a refugee too they kicked me out of here i have no place to go damn beggars can't be choosers bruh me i was born in nebradia my village was burned to the ground in the war two years ago and i made my way here I envy you, Dalmascan folk. Even an occupation's better than seeing your home and everything you loved reduced to a pile of ashes. Damn. So Nebradia... Hold on. Nebradia is like a, a city or a town or was in Ivalice. E e e e I mean, it, it wouldn't be on the map, right? But, well, Nalbina, I keep thinking getting Nalbina and Abradia, like, the same thing in my head.
Ah, another refugee. I can see you're weary. Please, eat and rest. You are safe here. I love this place. I mean, aside from the snow and the cold. They say the Grand Kiltius Anastasis can silence a king or even an emperor with a single withering stare. What I want to know is why does he hide up here on this mountain? He should be down there stopping those warmongers. Well, he must not want to get involved. What's eating? Is that a pizza? It looks like a stew of sorts, but it also looks very flat. I don't know what that is. <laughs> At home, I chased rats in the gutters for food, not for sport. Here I sleep with my belly full each day. It is like paradise, you see. Aren't these people cold? They're n none of them are wearing shirts. The Kiltius gave them food, but no food, no freaking clothes. Ah, a new arrival. Don't worry. No need to jump the queue here. There's food enough for all. It does kind of sound like a paradise, though, especially for somebody who has no home and who's been starving. We are all refugees from the Republic of Landis, fallen to the Empire long ago, before you were born, son. When we first came here, there were few of us enough. Now the fires of war rage outside. We are close to overflowing. The Empire has uh, destroyed a lot of lives. It looks it, from the sound of it. There's enough food for all, please, no pushing. Ahead on the temple grounds, there's a Viera named name of Relj. I've he I'd heard her kind were frigid, but that one is made of ice. Well, you probably have to be made of ice to make it out here. And now Clamp's craving ice cream. I had ice cream yesterday. You came through Golmore Jungle? Ah, yes, I see. You jape with me. We both know no Vera would allow a Hume to pass through their wood. But I'm... but I'm special. I'm the hero of the RPG. Of course I get through their special woods. Of course I do. You're just a... you're just an NPC, sorry to say. from here are the temple grounds never been myself they don't feed you up there see how many tents there are there's more every day i'm thinking to leave this place the more people come the less space there is for all but where will you go ah a pilgrim the temple grounds are ahead the light shine upon your path Rum. Okay. Let's check out the temple. Welcome to Mount Bromasais, holy mountain of the Celtius. May I ask why you've come to us? We're on a pilgrimage. I see, all are welcome here. So these temple grounds, through the temple grounds, you will find the sanctum where the Grand Celtius Anastasis presides. Hey, how's this thing floating? That must be Magicite? Because didn't they say Magicite? is what kept the uh 
a Bajurba those islands up? He's from Arcadia. Can't fly in Yagd, so I came by ship. But the view from here was worth the long journey. I'm no believer, but this place is impressive. Look at this guy. We cannot feed the refugees indefinitely, but must give them the means to feed themselves. If only one could magic foodstuffs. You can't feed them forever, but some of these people have been here before I was born, according to them. Or did they have a sudden increase, like, recently, that they can't... They can't sustain. Every day, we welcome more refugees seeking the protection of the Kiltius, and our capacity to feed and shelter them grows even more strained. Okay, they're reaching their... Their breaking point here. The building ahead is the main temple. Within you shall find the Hall of the Light, where His Grace Anastasis provide, uh, resides. You have the look of one who knows many techniques, but did you know that some techniques alter their range with different weapons? For instance, were you to use a soul eater upon a winged foe, a sword would not avail you, yet a bow would serve in good stead. A good grasp of the situation is essential to prevailing in combat. Okay, that's good to know then. The islands floating in the sky are said to be the remains of a great sky continent shattered and fallen long ago. Even now they bleed power, robbing airships of their buoyancy. Hmm. Ah, a pilgrim continued to reach the Hall of the Light where presides His Grace the Grand Kiltius Anastasis. The old and wise Numo leaders teach us Kiltius. Simply speaking with them is a revelation. My sleep is off troubled of late. I pray it is merely the nerves of an old man. Light, guide your path, Aram. Wow, look at this. We are up high and we're not even floating. Not this part. We're quite well integrated in this cliffside, though. Very good work. Worksmanship. Architecture. We Kiltius live in, on the gifts of believers. In the past, Nabrati and Damasca too gave generously, but those days are no more. Yeah, because of the stupid empire. The elders are concerned about the future of our mountain. mountain. Are the ever-swelling waves of refugees a sign of more evil to come for Rom? I ask that you remain quiet while in the Hall of the Light. His grace is a dream sage and must have silence. Do not disturb his meditation. The refugees' numbers are growing while the pilgrims decrease. It is sad. I would think the faith vital in times such as these. We're almost there. I came to the Paramina Rift, hoping to study a rare strain of worm known as the Viral. So, sadly, I've been most disappointed. If not the rift, where might it be? I'll bet you I could find it. Kill it, bring you back a scale or a tooth or something, maybe? Mount Buromasis is protected by the holy power of his grace, the Grand Kiltius. Once, long ago, a great worm filled with avarice sought to steal the riches of our mountain, but his grace proved uh, drove it off to pa Paramina. Paramina, Paramina, Paramina Figaro. 
Alone? Relge, do not say such things. Oh, this is the Viera Relge. Let me see what you gotta say. Alone. Leave me alone. The hearts of Humes are weak. I dare not grow close to them, lest mine grow weak as well. But you're talking to this human? Okay. I was hoping to get more out of her, but that's all the only line she has. This place looks really nice. His Grace, the Grand Kiltius, is a dream sage. He has known of your coming for some time. What? That's scary. His Grace Anastasis waits ahead. I don't know how to say his name. Anastasis? Anastasis? Anastasia? That's a movie. I don't know if I've seen that movie. Wow, he old. And he has like elf ears. Is he sleeping? No, my child. Whoa. Whoa. I do not sleep. I dream. For reality and illusion are a duality. Two parts of a whole. Only the mirror of dreams reflects what is true. Anastasis, your grace. I am Lay down your words. Ashelia, daughter of Ramanas. I have dreamt your dream. That's gonna be my new way of telling people to shut up. <laughs> Lay down your words. Who better to carry on the Dalmascan line than she who bears the dawn shard. Your dream of a kingdom restored is known to me. Grand Kiltius, then give us your blessing. Grant the Lady Ash her I accession to the... This is something you might reconsider. Who the heck are you? My little emperor in waiting. You called and I have come. <sighs> this is the man I wanted you to meet. Believe it or not, he is a member of the noble house Margrace, rulers of the Rosarian Empire. I am but one of very, very many. Try as I might, I could not stop this war alone. Thus, I came seeking Lars's assistance. Rosarian, huh? Uh... I'll seat Margrace at your service. To think I stand before the Lady Ash. It is truly an honor. Uh. I see it is true after all. Uh, stunning is Dalmasca's desert bloom. Uh. <laughs> in Arcadia, Larsa. In Rosaria, Al Cid. They dream not of war. Should Empire join with Empire, the way will open for a new Ivelisse in our time. <laughs> Grand Kiltius, you speak much of dreams, but in the real world, war is upon us. Grand Kiltius, I was told my coming here would prevent this war. I was to assume my father's throne and announce the restoration of Dalmasca, treat with the Empire for peace, and persuade the Resistance to stay their hand. I have not come all this way to be asked to reconsider. A word from you and the Resistance would stop cold, and Rosario's pretext for joining the war scattered off to the four winds. This was what we had hoped. Alas, circumstances change. A full two years have passed since your reported death. Were it to become known you are still alive, I fear it could only worsen our current situation. Because I am powerless to help. Uh, nay, in fact, it has little to do with you. Then what? 
If Lady Ash were to extend her hand in friendship, perhaps I could then persuade the Emperor. His Excellency will solve things peacefully. The Emperor Grammys is no more. His life was taken. <sighs> Father. Really? And he's finding that uh, this out like here, like this. What possible cause could we have to lay hand on our emperor? A deception and an outrage. The Senate will not stand for this. A viper amongst our senators. This chairman Gregoroth as its head. With what dignity remained him, he confessed to the poisoning and passed his own sentence. A viper with many tails. Much of the Senate is culpable. We had no choice but to strip the Senate of authority and assign powers of autocracy to myself until such time as order... Spare me your lies! I see the serpent coiled here before me! Trace, you speak too freely. Zargabath! Do not tell me you join in this mama's farce! With Rosaria poised to invade at any moment, our leader must have a free hand. <sighs> The once great House Solidor is now reduced to myself and my dear brother Larsa. Surely you would not go so far. Vain Solidor! As Judge Magister and upholder of the law, I hereby place you under arrest. <gasps> you misunderstand. Vain did not make himself autocrat. It was the very Ministry of Law which you serve. Do you see it now, Drace? When you bared your sword at His Excellency, you bared your sword at the law. You wear the mummers motley well, Bergen. Inhuman. Oh, he lives. Zargabath, take the Alexander. You will accompany Bergen and bring Larsa back to me. Sire. Your Excellency, Lord Larsa was placed under my charge. Oh? Perhaps you mistook your orders then. I can see no other explanation for why you were reporting and conjecturing on my doings to my late father. Your Excellency. A hound begging for scraps at the Emperor's table. Would you serve another master, hound? You may fulfill your duty as Judge Magister before us all. She has been tried and found guilty. Your Excellency, I beg you reconsider. Do it. I care not. Live, Gabranth. Protect the young lord. Protect Larsa. Forgive me. Pray be quick. like that and so how Solidor lives on let us suppose you approach the Empire with a peaceful resolution the late Emperor Grammys would have lent you his ear, that much is certain, but we are dealing with Vane Solidor. 
Should the princess return, he would claim her an imposter. Alt attempt the resistance into battle. Vane wants this war, that much is certain. As our ill luck would have it, the man is a military genius. The dreams have told me thus. To reveal yourself would imperil us all. I see war, and Vane's name writ bold on history's page. Arcadia's banners fly high. They are making ready for the coming war. According to our latest reports, the Western Armada prepares for war under Vane's command, no less. The newly formed 12th Fleet has already been deployed. Oh yes, the Imperial First Fleet stands ready. They'll be underway as soon as the Odin's refit is complete, and there is more. The second Caravan Expeditionary Force is being called in to replace the missing eighth, so there will be no gaps. The largest force ever seen! And then, the Nephesite is the coup de grace. Grand Kiltius, your grace. I spoke to you of my succession. Let us put that aside. Should I become queen of Damascus now, powerless as I am, I can protect nothing. With a greater power at my disposal, perhaps then. It is the Nethesite of which you dream? I require something far greater. To wield power against power. Truly the words of a Hume child. I am descended from the Dynast King himself. Indeed, then you have but one choice. Seek you the other power Wraithwall left. Does such a thing exist? Journey across the Paramana Rift to the still shrine of Miriam. There rests the gift he entrusted to the Grand Kiltius of his time. Seek it out. The Sword of Kings can cut through Nethesite. Why he would entrust the power to destroy Nethesite, the instrument of his greatness, to another and not to his own progeny, I cannot say. Awaken Hashelia Benagan and take up your sword or your dream will remain but a dream. My dream, too, fades into day. Bye, Larissa. Oh, man. I am... I'm, I'm literally nodding off. Oh. Oh, my gosh. I was asking for cutscenes and I just was not, I'm not prepared for cutscenes. Is there anything like, what are the important points that we, uh, we found out in those cutscenes? The, the main takeaways. Little recap. Al Cid. I think if I'm like playing and reading dialogue is a lot better than just watching cutscenes. The son killed his father and is ready for war. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. The Senate has been dissolved. And that one, that one girl was killed. But why? She wasn't on board with the coup. Being trying to remove anyone who doesn't support him. We're told to get the Sword of Kings to stop Vane. Okay. I'm gonna rewatch it later. He says he's doing all this for his younger brother Larsa. And an airship has been dispatched to get him, to get Larsa, bring him back. Larsa has gone to the inner sanctum with the Gran Kiltis. I believe the news of the Emperor's assassination came up something of a shock. Was I overly direct, perhaps? No matter, he is in good hands now. Yeah, I think the news could have been broken a little bit more gently. 
So this guy is from um, Rosaria. And he's the first Rosarian we've met, I think, right? Maybe. We probably talked to some NPCs maybe that are from there, but... The Sword of Kings is held deep within the still shrine of Miriam. Go south toward, uh, through the Paramina Rift. The light guides you, Faram. I'm ready to fight. The light may lack strength in arms, but we are not powerless. If the Grand Kiltius can stay, uh, can sway Arcadia and Rosaria, war can be averted. This is really nice. Very peaceful. No wonder I'm falling asleep. Alright, so back to the rift. We've done some shopping. We're good on items. So we get to the next uh, shop. And we will switch to our other other team let's check something does she have like new she has fira let's see yep she's got some upgrades here on her black magic stuff let's do a, a ko'd person phoenix down it's always good to have Ally KO, Phoenix down. And then we'll do Thundara, Lizara, Aqua. Let's get an arrow. Bow week two win. Arrow. What else you got, girl? What else can you use? Blinda? Oh, whale. Oh, weak to fire. We could do some some oil first, maybe. Hmm, okay. I think that's good. Do you have anything new? You have Soul Eater. Consume HP to deal damage to one foe. You have Infuse. Expend all MP, changing one ally's HP to ten times that amount. And you have shades of black. I guess maybe soul eater? But wh where would I use that? Like, what would I put it on? I think I might need... Maybe foe 100% HP. Kind of like... Balthier does steel. Maybe we could do... Soul eater? I don't know. Protect decoy, regen. Cure. I think we want cure to have precedent over regen. And do you have anything new? Oh, you have Kiraga. Oh, I still have her with Cure. Look at that. HP minus 40. Kiraga probably heals a lot. What else do we have? Dispel. Any foe? Will it... I don't remember if I've asked this. Will they use Dispel only if they ha if the foe has some sort of... um thingy? Slow. Immobilize. Only if they have a Dispellable buff. buff. Okay. Disable, vanish. Render one ally invisible. Interesting. Balance. Area damage equal to difference in caster's current and max HP. Area damage. So maybe... I mean, I don't uh, assume she's going to take a lot of damage, but if sure, her health is low, then maybe... I don't know. No, that's dumb. I don't think that's going to really work on her. Darkra. Darkra? If there are... Three or more foes present. Ooh, oh, I know what I want to do. 
know what I want to do. I want to buy gambits. Let's go buy them all out since we have the money. All right, gambits. I will take everything you have and I might regret it. <laughs> We're gonna get them all. We have, we'll have all of our options available. Ah, faux status oil. That's a good one. Disease. Ooh, that Thundara is nice. All right, so. I take it we're just going south. We can get the Sword of Kings in the Still Shrine of Miriam. Let's check our world map. Well, it is south of us somewhere, so I guess south it is. Switch targets. Come on, team. Pay attention. Which way? South? Soul Eater he heals undead. Do I have it? as a gambit right now? Oh, right. Oh, okay. Well, that's, that's why it's not good against undeads. Oh God, oh, I thought that was an elemental. Cause then they're just gonna be 100% HP the whole time cause they're gonna be healed. And then he's just gonna keep using it. these new abilities and I just don't know how to how to set them up and my gambits oh dear our labor ran out I think because we died oh god help me maybe I should just have him keep Libra on. I don't think that would be a bad idea. I don't think uh, he'll run out of M. He's not using MP for anything else, right? Self. Libra? Why does he still have a potion thing? I potion. back around so he was healing the skellies for 1900 while also taking 700 himself what a dummy what a dummy Bosch you a dummy
Got an ice shield. You know what? We should check our equips. Or optimize. Nice. Poor Vaughn doesn't even have an accessory on. What's up with that? Okay. Uh, yeah, we want to go this way. I like this area. This is nice. I don't mind doing a little bit of extra farming. Oh, look at that! The skeletons are not so tough. When you actually... Actually are hitting them instead of healing them. Imagine that. Oh, here's that ice elemental. chasing us? Something is chasing us. Chase me back to here. Okay. <laughs> I don't want to die. I don't want to die. Ooh. To walk this rift in ice and snow, this is part of our asceticism what does asceticism mean go up this slope and south from there to reach the still shrine of miriam everywhere you go in evilly there is war only on mount boromasace do we refugees find peace if you go to Mount Bromasace, you go the wrong way. Head southeast down the slope, then to the north. I've lost my way too many times here. And we just came from there, right? Asceticism. Severe self-discipline and avoidance of all forms of intelligence, typically for religious reasons. Oh, like monks and religious hermits. I got it. Got it. Asceticism. Fran needs more HP. Although she doesn't really get targeted too often since we have the decoy. Look at this thing. What is this? Twintania? It looks so weird. That face. Okay, where are we? We gotta go south. Look at that thing. What an interesting design on that enemy. Oh, I don't like this. Too many traps. Okay, um... Oh, Fran's silenced. No wonder. What am I doing? I need items. Well, if Fran gets silenced, that's kind of bad. Does she have any gambit slots left? She can use it for herself. If need be. Revive? Did I just get a... a magic? Does it say revive? Who has revive? Fully consume HP, fully restoring the HP of one KO'd ally. Oh. So it's like... You sacrifice yourself for the other person? 
Oh, uh, okay. I'm just gonna give him a phoenix down. That's gonna be quite sufficient. I feel about the fact that everybody here is short uh nobody's long range why did i put her and what if i put like pinello here or maybe switch ran out for balthier Could be, could be. Oh, 